Hey guys, it's your girl Durham. I'm just gonna show you what products I use just to get my face like this. So stay tuned. First and foremost, don't mind the hideous uh, not done brow. I have to go do my eyebrows, but I wanted to bang this out as soon as possible for you guys because I really enjoy this look. So um, let's just get started. I used my MAC Studio Fix in NC47 powder foundation to just do my T-zone because I don't want to wear liquid foundation with the humidity right now. Um, it goes on very light. I feel that I got full coverage with it. And then secondly, I did my eyebrows, which you're probably wondering like, why did she do her eyebrows? They're hideous. But uh, <laughs> I actually have really thin eyebrows and I have to fill it in and I filled it in from here up and down just I darken this one but this one has like a patch that it was missing so I had to fill up here and then bring it down Anyhow. and I actually used Maybelline New York Lip expert wear in ebony black and it's actually one of those twist tops that you can twist up and bring down. It's actually really cool because it comes with a little smudge brush when you want a nice smoky eye. You can do it up yourself. It makes, it, it makes the process 10 times faster. And then from there, I went and I did my, my underline of my, uh, eye, not my eyelid, but I guess like the eye crease or whatever. And to start it off, I used the War Paint Beauty Eyeshadow. It's called Blue Crush. It's actually really nice. It comes from Hot Topic. Sorry. There's a swatch for you guys. It's actually really heavy. It's pretty wicked. And I just put that underneath with my flat brush because I was really lazy and I was in a hurry today and I couldn't find anything. So I just used this. I'll make sure that I clean it. And I pretty much just went underneath quickly and just dabbled along until I got to the end. And I didn't like wing it out or anything like that because I don't want to. Then I went over it with my liquid eyeliner from the same line, War Paint Beauty. You can actually find War Paint Beauty products at Hot Topic. They're selling them now for $1.99. So if you really like funky colors, go there. I made sure that I got every single bright color that I could. This one is called Electro Blue. Hopefully my camera will focus and you guys can see that. But it's pretty dope. It's the color. So after I did under here, I just decided to put on some blush. This is a blush by MAC. It's almost like a salmon color. Salmon and pink, I guess. It's really nice. I like it. I don't know if you guys can see it, but in some pictures that I've taken over today, you can actually see the blush. It, it, I think it just flows really nicely with my hair, my look, and my lips. It blends well with my lips. Uh, speaking of my lips, I used Revlon. Their new, not, I guess the line that's out now. Uh, super lustrous lipstick. I got it in 667 Siren the number and it's almost like a more orange than red it kind of reminds me if it you know those creamsicles if it was darker it probably remind me of that color so you can see it there you can probably see it better on the other side so it actually looks pretty freaking awesome on my skin but the only thing is it's like it's so overbearing that I could only do like like a one two and that's it you know and I could only do it on my bottom lip because on my upper lip it looked really weird so I had to like thin it out and then use um Vaseline just to like give it the sheer cover that it needed and then of course I just used my falsies mascara and that's it that's how I got this look so if you like it try it out and if not then thanks for watching peace